YouTube, what it is, it's your boy Geddon, and we getting right into this joint right here, this is another episode of Soul Calibur Online Battles, episode 2, <laughs> yeah man, I really get into my little commentary or whatever, um, so this is my episode 2, and honestly, I did this, what, 3 weeks ago, believe it or not. I want you guys to pay attention. Look at the middle of the screen. You know, it happened a couple seconds ago, but the uh, I love this Soul Calibur online um, communicating with the servers. I like how they have the game, how they let you know what your connection is at all times, and they let you know your your opponent's connection, all that type of stuff. I love the online coliseum. I definitely recommend people picking this game up and playing it. I can't say that enough. Actually, I might actually make some um, tutorials just to help people um, understand the game a little bit more. Just real basic stuff that every fighter should know. You see in the middle of the screen, you saw that three with the three bars, right? That's the online connection. They let you know that before every round, not just every match, right? In this case, three isn't super, super great. There is some kind of connection frames and connection problems sometimes but overall three is okay i normally like to play i preferably play on you know four and five of course you know but you know sometimes you just gotta roll with the punches but you see it dropped to one this whole game right here was very lagged up <laughs> super lagged up this um first game that i played but like i said two three weeks ago um, looking at my gameplay now, like I've gotten so much better at this game, playing with uh, my Ms. Rugi Soul char character, my creator character. I even changed him around a little bit to make him a little bit better. And uh, you see, there's that one again. I just do not like that. <laughs> it messes up my all my timing and everything. As you can see right there, this guy is starting to whip on me because. I'm not used to the lag and it's throwing off my timing and you know he's really beasting me right now and he knocks me out of the damn ring. <laughs> That's very in interesting about this game because some characters have very good ring out throws as others you know they can't throw people out with their throws and stuff like that but they have some good um, hits and all that type of stuff you know. I love this game. I love me some Soul Calibur but I don't even know what the hell happened there. Maybe I went on the other side or something like that, sidestepped his uh, Soul Edge move. This guy was actually kind of decent. You know, I got him right here because he kept going to the well too much. <laughs> you know, the well, the well ran dry, motherfucker. Stop doing that Psycho Crusher and Bison shit, man. Um, so, at right now, I believe my record is 93 in the online Coliseum. Now, your online Coliseum, this is what I like too, your online Coliseum record is different than your rank record and different from your player match record. I love that, actually. I think that's beautiful. Um, I think right now it's like 96 and 27 or something like that, which is pretty good. Um, it's not like the best. I've seen people that are like 300 and so. Um, matter of fact, look at this guy. You know, he has, you know, a really good record. Me and him was fighting in this match right here this one came down to the wire i'm not gonna let you know who won though you know as you can see you know he's using that mizurugi soul um uh the same thing that i'm using and you know we're balling uh this person had a really good record and you can see we're doing almost the same tactics you know with mizurugi you can really really mind fuck the your opponent as you can see i went for that low uh swinging um uh, low hit he grappled me. I started to learn from that. And, you know, I kind of take advantage of that a little bit. You know, kind of, if you understand what I'm saying. You see, that's what I like about Soul Calibur. You know, there's so many moves. There's so much strategy to go to, to use in this game. You know, the, the sidestepping is very, very, very important. And then, you know, you could counter the sidestep. You know, it's some fighters where I don't understand the matchup that much. Because they are super, super fast and, you know, unorthodox at times. But, yeah, man. 
and thank God that <laughs> that canceled each other each other's out each other moves you know that that shit canceled out thank god that that happened because i sure enough would have lost and it's not looking good for your boy getting right now i'm losing to this person right now you know so we just we're just balling right now we are going at it they still winning you think it's over no it's not over here i go you moved yes you did <laughs> your boy getting with see you try to throw me that forget that oh and then you know what i'm gonna finish you off when I do that move, um, my character be like, I'll see you in hell. <laughs> That's how it goes down. Anyway, but no, I love, love, love this game. Um, I can't I can't stop playing this game. Um, it's between this and Call of Duty. Matter of fact, yo, honestly, that latest Call of Duty map that came out, Overwatch, that map is the best map <laughs> in Call of Duty history. Nah, I'm just playing. But it's a really good map. It's definitely the best map in in the um, all the map packs that they... Matter of fact, it's the best map in the game just about. You know, it's top two in the game. You know, it's a really good freaking map. As you can see, you know, that he was trying to throw me all these times. And I'm countering the throw. Um, that's what I learned before. And I'm so trying to win this game because this guy's record was pretty damn good i don't know what he was trying to go for right there that was cut just just dumb on his part and you know we're going at it down to the wire he got me he's he got him right there uh oh trick him got him oh can get him pull off the nah ain't gonna happen damn i was pissed <laughs> i was genuinely pissed about this matchup normally um but, it, you know, it's a pissed, and I respect the way he plays, obviously, because he's playing, yo, shout out to Sim F-Ball. He's playing with, you know, the same character I'm playing with, but essentially, you know, just different creator character. But he's not being cheap, you know. In every online game that you play, you're always going to play somebody or someone that wants to use cheap as tactics. Always, 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 always. So... You're going to come contact with that. That person actually was fighting me straight up. And and Soul Calibur is not a whole lot of cheap tactics, really. You know, there's some things you could do that's frustrating. That could frustrate your opponent. But it's really not that many, like, super cheap, cheap things to do. There's some characters that are cheap, you know. But you could counter that, you know. Or you could put easily get them, you know, scared of your moves so... Because Soul Calibur, when you knock people down, you can uh, you can really go for a lot of mix-ups, a lot of switch hits, a lot of tricking. Like right there, he probably didn't know what the hell I, I was doing, so I hit low and I went high. I changed my stance while I was running to keep the pressure on him. Change my stance, go high and low. That's what you got to do in Soul Calibur. Um, you got to not keep the opponent knowing what you're doing you have to always keep them guessing that's the best thing you could do in soul caliber once you've become obvious and predictable forget about it i'm trying to get a ring out right here you see me try to grab him right <laughs> i'm just trying to get a ring out and all those moves that i was doing was ring out potential moves and here let's see does he beat me i can't even remember man honestly and that yep yeah, he I, I believe he's yep yep he did his sidestep move and I was trying to roll out of that and get up, and shit didn't happen. Knocked off my shirt. But anyway, let's see what happens when I fight this big-ass guy. One of my favorite characters, Ashroth. You know, who knows if I'm going to win this. Most of the time, most of the time, these, these damn games, you know, sometimes, you know, I don't get nervous, you know, or when I play the game, this that was a sweet-ass grapple special he caught me with. And I'm surprised that um, it didn't do more damage. Because, honestly, Ashroth does take off a lot of damn damage. So, I'm glad that the boy didn't kill me. <laughs> but, you know what? Speaking of, you know, getting nervous when you play people and not knowing what the hell they're going to do. And trying to fight cheap tactics and everything. Sometimes, you know, that does get the best of you. Especially if you really care about if you win. And, you know, like say Call of Duty or KD or something like that. But... You know, speaking of Call of Duty or even this game, I rarely get like that anymore playing online. You know, even here when, you know, he could chomp off all types of damage to me. I don't, 
you know, I was just calm as shit playing this game. And I was trying to get my damn Soul Edge move to come out, but it did not come out. And that spells disaster for your boy Getting because he catches me with this shit all over again. He puts me in the blender. The Astaroth blender. And you saw all that damage it took off. Oh, painful, 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 painful. But like I was saying, yo, I was playing this and for whatever reason, I was just not nervous. I was cool as hell. I was playing like a damn tournament fighter, you know getting it in doing what i do and even though he was taking off chunks of energy and i fuck up right there you know i, I stay calm because i guess i played so much of soul caliber you know i just know so many things to do see he can't that's a new tactic that i was doing a new move you know a new time different timing and everything and he couldn't catch up to it so he paid the price beat him down son beat him down Yo, let's go into this next match right here. Okay, so you see um, that I won already two rounds, and those two rounds were like nothing. So this guy, he's just mashing buttons. He just wants to get one victory something out, right? So I was really just trolling him in a way, and <laughs> ring out, you're done. <laughs> That's just what I do, man. Sometimes, you know, winning a whole lot, sometimes a Soul Calibur. You know, you really could really easily map out your opponent. But anyway, check out these two videos. The one on the left, I got to tell you, it's a gem. It's a gem. It's one of my best movies that I've made. One of the uh, movies, uh, episodes or commentaries that I made. Speaking of movies and episodes and whatever, I think I actually might start making episodic videos using call of duty and other games i guess maybe so that's 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 that joint on the left on the right you know what that is that was my episode one if you didn't catch that you know this is the first time you see me doing this you're like why the hell is getting playing soul caliber because i'm a beast that's why check out that video let me know what you think thanks for the likes thanks for the subscribes um i want to get a lot more subscribers i gotta tell you right now i'm feeling like the best unknown unseen heard commentator out there i really do feel like i'm one of the best <laughs> unknown commentators out there you know check me out i ain't getting conceited or nothing like that you know it's just what i do and we out of here